Hello everyone, and welcome back to Risen. Now, last left off, we were trying to get some, we were trying to get the barrel, trying to get these uh, artifacts for a guy, only to wind up we ran into an ogre who was way too overpowered. Now I was thinking, maybe I need to do a little more upgrading, and then I realized I'm a freaking idiot. Let me explain why. For a good RPG open world, there has to be stuff. And let me tell you, did I find some? In fact, if I'm not mistaken, ah, here. There, these barrels, all these broken wood. Yeah, um, there's a mine here. A mine full of stuff. And skeletons. We got at a rusty sword. Uh, ball lock picks. Uh, take them all. Herbs. And I know you knew about prospecting. You and me both. Wait, what's this? Gold coin. All right. So I didn't realize this thing was here. In fact, there's a cave down on the um down on the shores. I didn't even know was there until I just decided to take a look at it. And what do you do? It was right there. It's like, damn it. If only I knew that was there. And, oh look, gnomes. Good thing about these guys. Oh boy. Good thing about these gnomes, they're not that hard to kill, but they're smarter than the. Ooh! They are smarter than the. Um... But they are smarter than. Uh, the get. They are smarter than the creature. Features you would normally have to face. Like, for example, Apple the Wolves and the Seagulls and everything else. Yeah, that. Yeah, that threw me into a freaking loop. Also, I don't know if I got. Hang on. And, um. Small Shield. Was that always there? Hang on. I'm, I'm gonna have to figure this all out after I get a. Uh, because we still got a whole bunch of stuff off until I actually know how to mine this stuff this will be a good place to go back to without any further ado let's go down here and did I kill these guys no I didn't yeah There we go. They sound weird. Hunting knife. These items would be good. Uh, when I was off doing my own thing, little known the fact that there was so much more on this nine thing. One thing I didn't realize is that. Uh, oh yeah, we're back out here. Yeah, one thing I didn't realize is that. Some items you get to trade with. And now we hit an auto save. So, I'm gonna get to the next point. I will show you when I get there. So, I'll be right back. Yeah, this woman here. I don't know what significant importance she has to this story yet. But eventually, I'll probably will find out. Oh, uh, maybe like when I. When something. Like. Here's my speculation. There's two writhing frac uh, fractions. Factions. <laughs> oh 
my god, uh, the math class is finally getting to me. <laughs> a little off note, I was... I, I, a little off note, uh, during my... I frack, uh, during my math class, you know, I'll, I'll tell you when we get there. Because <laughs> yeah, it's actually kind of funny. Ooh, Barry. Alright, so back to the area. It, uh, fractions. Oh, yeah, fractions. You know the funny thing is about fractions? Is that, uh, while doing it in class, doing one of my math class, um, there's these so many different fractions that you have to do. Who some you can take away, others you can other than add, but all the others that you have to like add on to the denominator hater, and then you have to add the both together. And you can't add the denominator. You have to match the denominator with another denominator. And I'm pretty sure you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, do you? Ooh. I'm just gonna go with the soy. Are you the local blacksmith? Blacksmith? I look like I spend my days making fucking old shoes. <laughs> I'm a pewterer, a gilder, a worker of fine metal. And I'm not looking for an apprentice. Particularly one that doesn't know the difference between a metal worker and a smith. If I did want to learn about metal working, how could I persuade you to teach me? You not listening? Someone spit in your ear or steal your brain. I don't want an apprentice. So why don't you just fuck off? I'm looking for new weapons. Looking is for losers. I ain't get you the goods. What have you got to trade? Alright, so here are all these fancy ass swords. Oh, it's some of them. Holy crap! As if I. As if I thought the you could get any stronger. Look at all these. Oh, I now since I have no way of actually getting now since I have no way of actually having any strength to do half of these things. My only purpose is the shield. So, and since I have no money to prove that thing, so I'm going to. Give him this, and this, all of these, is, eh, uh, yeah, oh, and I give him the, is, that should cover up, up, uh, wait, just, no, wait, oh, damn it, that just, oh, all of the, uh, I'll give him all the bolts, that still doesn't add everything up, alright, now, I have finally got uh, that. Do you need help? I'm looking for work. No one here looks for work. The only thing people here look for is gold. And you don't look like you're any different. Do you work with gold? Gold. Gold. Nothing but gold. You just see the money in it, don't you? Well, there's no point in you thinking about getting wealthy here. Every crumb of gold out there belongs to the Don. Well, I'm done here. Now, we have a very, very good hood shield. One that I think it will serve a really good purpose. Yes, now I gotta go... Again, not talking. But before I leave, um, the woman. I think she's going to play some significant role into this. Like, we have two riving fractions. Fraction. There I go again, same fractions. Factions, damn it. Two riving fractions. Yeah, two riving fra uh, factions. It's God, I can't talk today. Two riving fractions. That's the, um,. Uh, I don't know what to call these people. I guess bandits. I I don't know. I don't really know actually. Yeah, I, I'm gonna call them and bandits since they look like bandits. That's about as all I can think of, of at this point. Oh, oh shit! No, no, no. Um, 
No, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. Okay. Was it this way? No, that's not it. Oh, no, wait. I know where to go. Alright, so, Jesus. <laughs> There's just so much stuff. Just so much. Alright, so, next thing we gotta do is actually, uh, Go straight to a little village. A little village. Is I'll actually do a lot more help. And a water barrel. I really like this actually equal source of help. Probably restores my mana, but I don't have any magic spell. Was at this point. And you know the funny thing is, while I was off recording, are you doing these missions and I got I got a um I got a healing scroll. And as a dumb idiot, I thought Huh, that you can uh, use it as an infinite? No, you just use it once. It, it's similar to um, the older scrolls where you just get one thing. Hey, you go, that's it. And it's like, damn it. Okay, enough on the category ground. We gotta go to Harbor Town. We're not going to go into the town because, as well. Okay. We're not going into Harbor Town. Because is that a normal wolf? Is that a hungry wolf? Oh, that's just a hot. Ah, yeah. Now I just realized the difference between a normal wolf and a hungry wolf. Hungry wolves are weaker. Yeah, hungry wolves are weaker. Eager. <laughs> All right, so go down here. We got the bandits and we got the Inquisition, which I guess they're like the, uh, like sort of the Romans in this whole fantasy universe. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. Welcome, stranger. What's brought you to our troubled isle? The tide. I'm a shipwreck survivor. Well, it's a strange kind of luck that's washed you onto these shores. But I must warn you, you cannot wander freely around here. I don't mind. But the warriors of the order are less forgiving. What is this place? Just a simple farm. It's under the control of the Inquisition now. We cultivate the land and take care of the animals. Our work ensures the well-being of the order and Inquisitor Mendoza's men. Who are you? My name is Tristan, a novice of magic. I'm looking after this place on the orders of the Convocation of Mages. You mentioned the Convocation. What do the Mages have to do with the Inquisition? The Convocation of Mages has long had their seat here in the Monastery, at the foot of the Great Volcano. It was a place of study and faith before the Dark Wave covered the land and those temple ruins had risen from the ground. And now the Inquisitor is here seeking to push back that darkness. We're very lucky he found us in our hour of need. Now the Monastery not only serves as the Mages' home, but also as a training camp for recruits of the Inquisition. I see. I'm looking for work. Well, there is more than enough to do on our farm. Go to my brothers and let them assign you a task. We do not have much, but we still value honest work. Yep. I will do, do that. Alright, so... We got the Inquisition, which... No doubt, ooh, egg. It's probably a rotten egg, but still... Uh, we got at uh, the Inquisition, who is in control of this town. The Inquisition are the Inquisition. Yeah, is apparently the Roman emperors, the like the Roman arm, the Roman Empire. Oh, yeah. And if you remember the story that mankind somehow banished the gods, and then these temple wars come out, which I'm assuming these are titans. <laughs> Rising out of these temples, it was the Roman Empire is going to try to find a way to push them back. Hey, so we got rival faction and fractions. God, I for so I keep repeating the words fraction. Actually, I've been hearing them a lot in my, my math class, and now I can't stop repeating them. Factions. There's two different words. Anyway, factions. There's bandits and inquisitions. Is I'm going over and over it again. And like a freaking idiot. Um, I'm assuming you as the player, or the and this character here, is the um, 
is the one is the one chance this is this um how do I say how do I say it's the how do I say like you, um, like you are the key point to winning a war like I'm assuming there's gonna be a war and one of the factions wins and then the woman gets kidnapped by either of these guys and well Then we have to go and kill one of the factions. Anyway, so let me show you. Watch your feet. There's grain growing here. Do you need any help here? No thanks. I could have done with you a while ago though. Thanks anyway. Uh, so that guy I don't know how much important it is to talk to him, but this guy needs help. Are you crazy walking around here? What do you think will happen if the Inquisition catch you, eh? Yep. What do you do here? I'm working in my field. Your field? Yeah. This one's mine and the other one on the other side of the path is Teller's. Of course, he's further along working his one. Always is. Don't know how he does it. He's already taken his whole harvest to the storehouse. But I'm afraid I won't be able to get my harvest in on time. I can't spot the ripe plants from the unripe. They all look the same to me. Do you need help? You serious? Well, I wouldn't say no. And what kind of compensation would not saying no come with? Well, I'm only a novice, so I don't have much. But if you harvest the plants and bring them to me, I'll give you a healing potion. How about that? Deal. I'll bring you those ripe plants. Great. Then I might actually be able to start my mage training before this place goes completely to the dogs. Just look out for the ripe ones in my field, all right? Ten should be enough. Bring them back here, all right? All right, so there we go. Now, it's weird because they're barely, you can barely spot them out, but it's like the grain looks like a brown, like completely brown. Uh, which is Yeah, like like that. It looks like that. Like really, really green. I don't know why I thought it was brown. Maybe because that's what it a normal grade looks like. Uh, I'm not gonna go play. Hey, this is a pretty damn awesome game. Hey, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, so, um. Uh, gray, gray. We got more gray in here. Here, we got seven gray. It's gone. I think I'm getting them a lot quicker. Okay, whoa, what? What? Um, okay. Uh. Uh, gray. Any more grain? Oh, there's grain. And one last one. I think it's the last one here, I think. No. Where is it? Where, where's the grain? Again, it's very hard to spot out in the middle of these tall grass. I gotta, like, like chickens. Okay. Where the freaking hell is the grass? Okay. I swear to God, I am going to lose my mind if I can't seem to find this single the last chicken! <laughs> oh my God. I can't believe I can't find this last gray. Hey, this wasn't that hard to try to find it the last time. Wait, what the? <laughs> My God! Hell! What? I saw nothing there. They took it. Oh, okay, okay, fine, fine, yeah. fine. 
Eh. Here are your ten ripe plants. Thanks. Without you, I would have been in a whole world of trouble. The healing potion is yours. Ah, thank you. How often do these warriors of the Order come up here? The Inquisitor sends one once every couple of days. They like to keep a check on things. He picks up what we've harvested and the meat and takes it to the monastery, where they no doubt stuff their faces. If I were you, I'd hide when he shows up. Thanks for the warning. Oh my god. Oh my god. That literally took me 10 minutes to try to find this one last crate. I've been looking all through the... his patches several times, yelling at chickens because I thought... because for some reason I thought how the chickens were the grains, but then when I look upon further, no, they're just the chickens. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> I am really aggravated right now. <laughs> I am, truly am. Now, let's talk to this guy here. Hey, how are things going here? Not so well. Stuck in the middle of nowhere, a place where no one wants to be. You're the happy-go-lucky, face-live-with-a-smile type, aren't you? And you'd smile if a pack of hungry wolves was eating everything in sight. I used to have six pigs, and now look at what's left. Hungry wolves. Just my thing. It does you credit that you want to help me, but I have to warn you. Those beasts haven't been here for several days. I figure they must be starving by now, so they'll be really dangerous. Any good news? Well, they're wolves, so none of them have swords. <laughs> if you back in two days, I'll assume they put you on the menu. Great. All right, so... Where do the wolves come from? There's a small cave over there. To the north of here. I haven't been there, but I'd be willing to bet that's where their lair is. Alright, so here's the funny thing. For some reason, I thought uh, north up here were the wolves. Right? And there were tons of them. But no, those aren't actually the wolves. Those I was supposed to kill. In fact, they're just right up here. Before I go any further, I need to save. Alright, so, yeah. Hungry wolves, they're not that tough. So, they'll be easy to kill. Look, but you get. Gotta be careful with these guys because. Now, they no doubt do this to you! There we go. Because the wolves I have encountered were a lot bigger than this one. And by God, were they really, really stronger than ever. So, take all. Alright, so. Now what's this? A small diamond. You know, I probably should have came down here, here to pick up of the stuff before trading with that blacksmith but at uh, this way hey I really need the shield because this shield provides a lot more uh, protection now here's what I normally do with these two walls here I am going to lure them straight into the this little hallway in and choke them there If only... If one thing... <laughs> you with the freak! Okay, okay. Thank you. Oh my god. 
Oh my god, that's way too hilarious. Now, yeah, if I have learned anything from my time playing any of these open world maps, as especially either fantasy ones, like, um, again, Dark Souls, Blood, Bloodborne, I tried to get them in a tight cor I tried to get them into a tight, tight, narrow space. So that way they won't be able to surround me that easily. Let's get this guy's attention. How did that not hit him? Last arrow. So, the funny thing is about the, is, is that, yeah, they're gonna, like, jump around, but if it's just one enemy, I can deal with, but there's a multiple there, they can attack me at any time, which is going to be really difficult. Oh, sometimes one will attack, others will, uh, try to attack me, he, and, oh my god. Yeah! Something will definitely attack me. A whole lot more. Than anything else. Something's over there. Okay. Lump of iron ore. I definitely need, need to make some room. Go back to this. Holy crap. Crap. So, oh my god, uh, how much do I have? I have very few space. This is, um, what should I eat? I'll eat this, this, gold. Wish I knew about prospecting. Yeah, me too. But, if I find a way to mine, then I'll definitely will come back here. That's a weird lucky chance. Anyway, back up we go. And that same guy will probably be here. It, uh, hi. How you doing? Hey, you. I have to warn you. There is a warrior of the order on the farm. So? So... You aren't actually allowed to be here. If he sees you, he'll have you taken to the monastery. So what do you suggest? We'll have to wait here until he leaves. Follow me, keep quiet, and you can hide in our storehouse. There's a bed there. Get some rest. The warrior will be gone in a couple of hours. Understand? What do I need to do? All right, I'm going back to my post. You follow me, try to be inconspicuous. Stay to the left and you'll find our storehouse. Get some rest in there. When you wake up, the warrior should have gone, all right? Right. Well, I suppose I'll have to trust you. Great. Let's go. And make sure he doesn't see you. Try not to. Now, great thing about has shift. All you have to do is just walk. This is great. <laughs> All right. Any further ado, now I'm gonna go straight to bed. Sleep until noon, that should be good. Yeah, I'm not even gonna uh, take them. I, I mean, all clear. 
The warrior's gone. It was a good job I saw you first, or you'd be on your way to the monastery. I'd say you got lucky there. Those wolves are dead. You killed them? That's a relief. I can finally sleep peacefully again. Here, take this as thanks. I could never have done that alone. I hope you'll find your way, my friend. I hope so too. Farewell, and thanks. Alright. Now that I've done on everything, I still don't think I'm strong enough yet. So, next time. Oh, hey, hey, hey. No need to attack. I'm fine. Now, I'm probably going to end this right here because this next time I'm going to keep on doing more things with the farm. Alright, so hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching. And be sure to check out. Actually, no. No, I'm going to change it after this. Yes, I'm sorry. Alright, guys, but until Dream Crusher. The situation until Dream Crusher Media has stopped, there's probably not going to be an outro. Probably not for a while. Because I am working on a different one. On uh, and. Well, we'll see how to go from there. So. I'll see you in the next video. Later.